T-minus 30. T-minus 10 seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. And we have ignition. And we have liftoff of Antares. The door three mission, the ring thickness on its third CRS mission, the ISS. Got main engines at 108%. And launch team, launch team, be advised, stay at your consoles. Everyone in the LCC, maintain your positions in your consoles. In the LCC, maintain positions at your console. And for now, standing by for uh, updates and information from the launch control uh, out there at Wallops. We will continue to bring you information as it comes available. And if you're just joining us, this again, a live view from the pad out of the Wallace Flight Facility, an explosion occurring shortly after liftoff of uh, the orbital CRS-3 mission on its way towards the station. We are standing by and will continue to bring you any updates as they come available. Director on the Countdown Net. This time we're going to implement contingency operations for today's uh, launch activity. I'd ask all personnel to stay on console and to prepare to uh, to review uh, witness statements and secure data. And again, if you're just joining us, this again, a live view from the uh, launch pad out at the Wallops Flight Facility in Virginia. 
Uh, an accident occurring just about six seconds after liftoff of the Antares rocket carrying orbital CRS-3 uh, cargo mission. From all personnel that a, a mishap has occurred at pad 0A, we have lost the Orb-3 vehicle. And at this point in time, we're going to implement the Antares CRS mission contingency reaction plan.